Premier 6D5 Passenger Touring 1920. 65 bhp, 205.3 cubic inches overhead valve inline 6 cylinder engine, 3 speed manual transmission with Cutler Hummer electric shift, solid front axle and live rear axle with semi elliptic leaf springs, and 2 wheel mechanical brakes. Wheelbase, 126.75 inches. Offered from the estate of John O'Quinn. Pioneering aluminum engine. Novel Cutler Hummer Electromagnetic Shift Premier was one of the early cars made in Indianapolis, Indiana, but it is the later models that are better remembered, because of modern innovations introduced in the teens. Actually, the Premier was quite advanced from the beginning, using overhead valves and a sliding gear transmission in 1903. In 1918, however, came the aluminum 6 with magnetic gear shift, Aluminum engine blocks had been in use since 1916, but 1918 brought a transmission controlled by an electromagnetic mechanism produced by Cutler Hammer. Attached to the steering column was a pod containing push buttons, much in the manner of Packard's nearly four decades later. The Premier did not shift automatically, but pushing the button for the desired gear was claimed to complete the shift, electrically, in one-fifth of a second. As an added convenience, it dispensed with the shift lever on the floor of the driving compartment. The O'Quinn collection purchased this 1920 Premier in the mid-2000s. Upholstered in black leather, it has jump seats in the rear compartment for a total of seven passengers. Dual spotlights are mounted on the windshield stanchions, and a motometer graces the radiator cap. By the early 1920s, most automakers had abandoned V-radiators so the Premier's nose is a welcome throwback to that earlier streamlined era. Wide white walls provide a nice contrast to the black fenders and chassis. Ahead of its time, the new owner will certainly be the first on the block to offer rides in an aluminum 6 with magnetic gearshift.